Hey YouTube, what's up? Blue Witch here. So, tonight I'm doing a really fun, for me, prosperity spell. And this prosperity spell isn't your average prosperity spell. Okay, so this, my client, is freaking awesome. She cracks me up. She made me laugh this morning with her list of things that she needs. Um, she just is, she's funny. Anyway, so, um, so she needs this apartment and she has no furniture. She's starting over and so she needs this furniture store to give her you know, a credit limit so that she could just, you know, get whatever furniture she needs. And then she needs prosperity. She needs, um, you know, monies to open up for her. She just needs to be prosperous in her whole life. Like she's starting over basically. And, um, so we're going to do a prosperity spell for her. Um, but it's, to be prosperous. In all areas. Really? You guys. They just knocked over my bean bag. My bean bag just flipped. And everything that was sitting on the bean bag fell over too. You guys, put it back, please. You're so cute. Well, I'm sorry if I didn't acknowledge you. I'll be doing this casting with Billy L. Because he's my, he's my fave and I love to cast with him. And I've already done my sigils, my blood offerings. Um, done all those things that I use that I don't do on YouTube. You guys don't get to see that very often. Occasionally, I'll do it on YouTube, but not normally. Normally, that's private between myself and my and my gods and goddess. And so, I don't usually do those things. On anyway, so um, I have blood on everything. <laughs> seems like and um. Have your beautiful candle ready right here. I am going to be doing some knot magic on it. Um, this is the the string I'm going to be using is orange as well, and I do put blood on my string when I do knot magic as well. Um, I did want to say this because I'm casting for you tonight and tomorrow night. I want you to make sure if the energy gets to be too much for you that you let me know and I will do a calm down candle. Um, I did a casting for a client a month ago and she contacted me this morning saying that the energy is just still off, you know, too much. And so, um... I'm going to be doing a calm down candle for her later on. I won't be, I don't videotape that. I'm, it's just something I just do. I have some beautiful um, white candles and then I put like um, uh, St. John's wort and calamine and lavender, I believe is the mixture. I have, I have like a calm down, you know, some herbs in a jar, you know, that I use. Anyway, so back to this. I'm really happy that 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 you chose me to do this spell for you because I really like you. I like your energy. You're funny, I can tell. I can tell. You're like, this is what I got from you. You know, like, oh, there's a mom. This is what I got from you. I got that, that you're like, I done fucked everything at you. My life's all fucked up. I need to redo. Let's start over. You know, you're starting fresh. And that... You know, that's what I got. But anyways, um, so, my darling, we are going to get started on this. I'm going to carve your candle first, and then we will go from there. I'm going to be putting the address um, of the place that you want to rent 
on here. And I'm going to be, I don't know if I'll put the furniture store on here or not. Maybe. Who knows? But it'll, I have a written petition as well that I'll be putting everything on too. I do, I always usually do two petitions, one on the candle and one on the parchment paper. And so that's just how I do it. Anyways, I'm sure you already know that. But, okay, so first I'm going to start with your name. over my bean bag. That is just wild. Do you guys want the ghost radio on? Is that why you're throwing things around in here? Well, let's put it on so you can talk. Then you don't have to kick over my bean bags. to write the address of the apartment that you want and I know you said you want a bottom floor and all that good stuff oh that was fast you're already on that is what you wanted you guys have a temper don't you I didn't put really muscled, so you're going to have to speak up a little bit, okay? I'll put it like this so I can hear you better. Existing. Okay, so now I'm going to write open roads to housing, open roads to prosperity, open roads to Covens. Maybe someday we'll have a coven, but not not right now. <laughs> okay, so this place. Oh my gosh, friend, this furniture place that you sent me—they have really nice furniture. You know the round table in the flyer thing that you sent me. That is freaking badass. I love that. I want that. 
I'm gonna like go to Vegas just to get that table. If I were you, I would pick that round table in there. It's really pretty. It's I'm listening to you. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Okay, then across the across the bottom, well right here first, off and foremost, I have this one space right here and I'll be carving Belial Sigil right there because that's who I'm working with tonight. Very good, very good. Okay, now I'm gonna go ahead and do the knot magic before I start with the um, um, the written petition and the oils and everything. I like to do this first. And like I said, I've already put blood all over this, which is blood is very powerful. Like it. So I tie this knot. I open the roads to prosperity. that is desired. As I tie this knot, I command that all that wealth and success come to you. As I tie this knot, I command that wealth and success come to you. As I tie this knot, I command that you are successful in everything that you do. One more. As I tie this knot, I command you prosper. Money and wealth be opened up to you freely. Money and 
wealth come to you freely. Um, so in my Open Road Prosperity herbs that I have made right here, um, I added a few new herbs to it today that I got in for prosperity. I also um, cut up little tiny pieces of money, like dollar bills, my shredded money. I chopped it all up really teeny tiny, mixed it in there with all the crystals and all the herbs that are in there, and it is beautiful. It's a beautiful thing. Okay, now going to write your petition out, finish your petition. And set that there and let it just relax. Relax. We are giving out the money oil for that. over the bean bag? Who knocked over the bean bag? Tell on him. Who did it? Just dump it on there. There we go. Okay. So I'm going to write your name on here a couple more times. Okay, so now I'm going to write um, the name of the apartments that you want. ground floor. Eligible. Make sure that she is eligible. Okay, so I have um, your petition is written for that. Now I'm going to turn it clockwise and I'm going to write all the other stuff that I would like for you to have like success, prosperity, wealth, you know, all those good things. How old am I? I'm, I'm 51, I think. I'm 51, I'll be 52. Things like prosperity, success, wealth. What? Are you the 
someone who knocked over my bean bag? Who kicked the bean bag and knocked it over like that? That's what I want to know. Oh, you're so sorry. That's okay. Was it an accident? It's okay. It's just a beanbag. It didn't hurt anything. I'm not mad. I was just wondering who did it. Did you trip over it? Was it in your way? I'm writing um, good luck, open roads to success, wealth, prosperity, um, um, job opportunities, open roads to, oh, um, good luck. You really need good luck because you live in Vegas. Right? Okay, we got it. We got it. Okay, so now is what I want to do. Your picture. Okay, so now what I want to do is I'm going to put some money oil on your picture. I don't know why this is being so difficult. I like the dripper thing used to work. Oh, that's why there's a big old thing clogged in there. There we go. That ought to do it. Still, whatever. Intelligence. Perfect. Okay, now I'm going to put some herbs on you. And now I'm putting this petition on you. actual shredded money. I know that you had some specific things that you wanted to work on in this spell. And so you have so much going on. So I did it in a way that it's just to open everything that you need. Everything um, in your life that's stuck. Every road that every road that you need open for just everything to be open to you. Um, so that you can be successful and do whatever it is that you want to do. Um, that way we don't limit the spell. I don't like to put limits on my casting, especially for open road castings. I feel like that's a big mistake. I think it's better to leave it open for you to be blessed in ways that you could never imagine. Where is 
with my Factor. Okay. Do you know who I am? You're an entity? What kind of entity? Do you have a name? Can you show me your sigil? Oh, you're here to give me assistance? Oh, thank you. Why are you being so negative? Oh, are you the one who, who knocked over the bean bag? It's okay, I don't care. It's just a bean bag, but it's just kind of... Well, well this person... I would like you to go to Las Vegas and open the roads for her to help her be successful in anything that she wants to be successful in. Help her get her apartment. Help her jewels. Yeah, give her jewels. Get it, give her whatever she wants. Whatever she wants. Wants to give you jewels. Alright, where's my... My wax. Who's depressed? Is she depressed? Well, make her feel happy. She's got a lot going on. She's starting all over, you know. And hard not to be depressed a little bit, you know. Sweetheart, there you have it. Um, so, this is the first candle. There'll be two more days of candles burning on this spell. And then, and then it'll be finished. And then it'll get buried. Um, but it's really pretty. I'm going to turn the camera around and show you guys how they knocked over the bean bag because it's pretty funny. Did you knock it over or did someone else? Oh, he left. Anyways, I'll show you guys what they did. Look. It's kind of funny. So you can see. Do you see that bean bag over there? Yeah, they knocked it over. It was fine. You've been sitting there like that all day. Well, for a week or so, actually. Okay. That's my purse tipped over. I don't know if you guys know anything about bean bags, but they don't just tip over like that. That's not a little tip either.
right, you guys. Bye. I'll see you later.